Evening all, um, welcome to the video of our latest van. Bit of a change, we've not done a high top for a while. It's all pop tops. But this is a um, 2016 Transit Custom L1H1, so short wheelbase, high top. Um, starting with the front, so we've got the double swivel seat. Uh, this van will actually take six passengers. It's got obviously three in the front and the uh, rock and roll bed which does have headrests they're just not fit at the moment that carries a further three people um, so you have your fridge your, your Waco fridge which also has the freezer box inside useful drawer there and we've got the SMEV single burner and sink Gas, lock, gas bottle and electrics are down there. You can see the storage net. We've got storage under the rock and roll bed with the cupboard there. Obviously, we've got the two, the big large overhead lockers there, and there's another large overhead locker above the driver's head. We do have a cab divider curtain, which will front and rear. So I'll just put the front one in place. So when it does get to bedtime, we put that across at night, just make it a bit warmer, a bit cosier, and a bit more private if you haven't got the silver screens on the outside of the window. Um, the further curtains all round, and there's the light switch is with a 12 volt and a USB and the battery level gauge. This van does have solar panels. It also has the 230 volt hookup when you're on your campsite. Shovel table which is removable and then going to the rear. The customer didn't want rear windows and um, obviously you can see just how, how bright that light is so when you're loading your bikes etc you can see it really lights up the area. We've got lots of storage on the back doors with the fire extinguisher there, the, the cupboards were supplied by the customer they were already there and again same this side Lots of storage nets, more cupboard space, and just at the back as well, we have another 230 volt socket with a 12 volt and a storage net for your mobile phones to charge at night. And there we can see the control for the planar diesel heater, switch for your fridge, another 230 volt socket, and another 12 volt socket. There we go, guys. Hope you like it. Something a bit different. Like I say, we've not done a high top for a while. Um, so obviously it's a cheaper option than having a pop top if you need to sleep, two of you. But you can also add an awning and sleep in that. Okay guys, thanks for watching. Goodbye.